Tegu Selva, welcome to the topic of number bases. Now, every year, without fail, there are two questions on number bases in Paper 1, SPM Mathematics. Then the bases we are talking about are base 10, base 8, base 5, and base 2, binary system. Right? Now, if you want to answer the questions in SPM easily, you must be well versed with the techniques of conversion from one base to another base. Okay? Now, here, here I have for you a clone question based on the year 2005. Paper 1. SPM. Okay, let's see how we solve this question. This is a binary number, okay? Base 2, right? 1 minus 0 is 1. 0 minus 1, you cannot. So what do you do? You borrow 1. When you borrow 1 in base 2 means you borrow 2. In our base, base 10, when we borrow 1, when we carry 1, that means we are carrying 10. We are borrowing 10. In base 2, you borrow 1, that means you base 2. You borrow 2. 1, 0 is 2. 2 minus 1 is 1. Okay? Now, this 1 you have already carried to the other side. 0 balance. 0 minus 0? Zero. 0. 0 minus 1. Okay, now you borrow 1 here. Yeah. So, 1, 0. 1, 0 is 2. 2 minus 1 is 1. This 1, you already borrowed here, left with 0. This is 1. This is your answer in base 2. This is your answer. Okay? I hope you get it. It is very, very simple. Base 2 is very simple. Thank you. Hi. Here I have for you a clone question based on the year 2005 again. But this time you are given a number in base 5. 2, 3, 1, 4, base 5. And from here, you are supposed to find the value of digit 3 in base 10. Okay. Before we go forward, what we do is, we write the arrangement of base 5, which is very, very important. Now, this is unit. This 4 represents unit. 5 to the power of 0. 5 to the power of 1. 5 square. 5 cube. Now, in base 10, is 10 to the power of 0, 10, 10 square, 10 cube, 10 to the power of 4, and so on. Unit, tens, 
hundreds, thousands. That is in base 10. In base 5, unit, this is unit, 1, this is 5, okay? This digit represents 5s, this digit represents 25s, this digit represents 125s. Okay? You get it? Until here? Now, we are only focused on the digit 3. This one. So, you are asked to find the value of digit 3 in base 10. So, 3 times 25 equals to 75. That is your answer in base 10. The value of digit 3 in base 10 is 75. Very simple. I hope you get it. Thank you. Hi. Here I have for you a clone question based on the year 2007. Okay, let's see how we solve this. 5 times 8 cubed plus 2 times 8 squared plus 8x or 8 times x huh? equals to 5, 2, 3, 0 in base 8. You are asked to find the value of x. Okay, again, this number is base 8 this time. So, we look at the arrangement of base 8. So, this is the arrangement of base 8. 5, 2, 3, 0. 5, 2, 3, 0, base 8. So, if it, this number is in base 8, this represents unit 8 to the power of 0. This digit represents 8 to the power of 1. This digit represents 8 square. This digit represents 8 cube. Okay? Now, what is 8 to the power of 0? Is 1. Unit. Okay? This is unit. This is 8. This is 8 squared. 8 cubed. So actually 8 squared is 64. 8 cubed is 512. But we are not interested in anything here except x. We want to find the value of x. Okay. Now, if you look very carefully, 0 times 1 is 0. So, the last digit is 0. Okay? Last digit is 0. Now, how many 8s are there? How many 8s are there? 3. How many 8 squared are there? 2. How many 8 cubes are there? 5. So if you look very carefully, you see? There are 5 8 cubes. There are 2 8 squares. So, consequently, there are 3 8 3 8 therefore x is equal to 3 that is your answer very very simple if you know the arrangement for base 8 okay i hope you have got it it is not very difficult thank you Here, 
I have for you a clone question based on the year 2008. Now in this question, you are supposed to convert from base 5 to base 8. Now in order to convert from base 5 to base A, you have to convert from, you see, from base 5. If you want to convert to base 8, you convert to base 10 first. Then from base 10, you convert to base 8. Okay? This is the technique. Okay? Standard technique. So first, we convert to base 10. How do we convert to base 10? Watch. This is unit 5 to the power 0. This represents 5 to the power 1. This digit represents 5 squared. So, 5 to the power 0 is 1 unit. 5 to the power of 1 is 5. 5 squared is 25. So, 4 times 1 is 4. Plus 2 times 5 is 10. Plus 3 times 25 is 75. So, when you add all this up, 75 plus 10 plus 4, you get 89. 89 base 10. 89 base 10. Now you got to convert from base 10 to base 8. So how do you convert? Base 10 to base 8, this is what you do. You divide 89, divide by 8. 1, 1, remainder 1. Divide by 8 again. You must divide until you get a digit less than 8. So 1, remainder 3. So this is your answer. 1, 3, 1, base 8. This is your answer. 3, 2, 4, base 5 in base 8. 1, 3, 1. Very simple. Learn the technique and apply it all the time. Practice. You should become very good in the future. Thank you.